The smell of barbecue is in the air, and that can only mean one thing. It's time to enjoy another rib fest presented by the Rotary Club of Niagara Falls Sunrise. The popular fundraiser has a new home this year at Rapids View Park in Niagara Falls, which offers plenty of parking, green space, access for tourists, and proximity to the falls. Yeah, so this is our 15th annual event. Uh, so this year we're at a new location. We're here at Rapids View Park on Niagara Parks Commission property. Uh, it's a great venue. We we're very happy to get it. And uh, yeah, things are working out well so far this year. So the change in venue, was that a little bit more difficult than it's been planning in years past? Yeah, it's definitely when you go to a new site, there's a lot of new things to consider and planning the layout and so on uh, is you know more difficult than being at the same venue. But uh, it's worked out well. This was our number one choice and we were able to uh, work with the Niagara Parks Commission and, and get this venue secured for us. So parking is free all weekend long and yeah we're hoping because of the proximity to the hotel and the tourist district that we're able to attract more uh, out of town people to come to the event. Yeah, not too much different. We've got the same uh, rivers that we've had before. We've got a great relationship with them and happy to have them back. A lot of the bands, the entertainment that we have this weekend are bands that people would be familiar with attending previous Rip Fest. And uh, yeah, and a lot of the other miscellaneous vendors and uh, other food vendors. We have 10 other uh, food vendors uh, other than Rivers that are here so a lot of them are repeats as well they've been uh, part of the Rib Fest for a long time so. Okay we're here with Alex from Bone Daddy's so Alex what makes you guys the best river that's here? Uh, well last year I believe we won Judge's Choice I think that's four times in a row I believe it says up on our sign so it all comes down to our sauce we cook great ribs and put those both together and we get a winning uh, weekend. So what's the secret to the best sauce? Uh, I'd have to let the customers try that out secret so the sauce and is anything going to the cooking as well uh, we just smoke our ribs for a few hours our pork smoke for nine other than that we toss on the grill and then we put our secret sauce on there and that's it any words of competition for the other rivers uh, good luck <laughs> all right David we've been getting some friendly competition here what's gonna set you guys apart at this year's rib fest Oh, that's easy. Uh, last year we won here actually, so we're the defending champions. Uh, we took home People's Choice uh, Award last year, which was great. But other than that, it's our attention to detail. Um, our, our spice rub that we use, the sauce, and of course the, the wood that we smoke with. And the Hawk Father, you guys are located in Fort Erie? Yes, a small town called Ridgeway. So yeah, we're local and uh, we know a lot of people here. Yeah, so our, our sauce is a nice, sweet, smoky, good blend, great flavor profile. Now, the Hawk Father, do you guys change it up every year, or are you coming with the Delicious. same one you guys had last year? Oh, we come in with the same one. Our award-winning sauce, we don't change that up. Can you tell us a little bit about Falls View Casino's involvement with the Rip Fest? So our associates really are the inspiration for our community giving program, NC Community. Through their volunteerism and participation in events such as these, we look to leverage that with corporate support to really help make our community the best it can be. The Rotary Club of Niagara Falls and the charities they represent really resonate with our 4,200 associates. And we look to take that and kind of communicate it forward to our team to help bring it to its full potential. Um, the Rotary Club in itself works with hundreds of charities in the region and the Rib Fest benefits um, Literacy Niagara, Boys and Girls Club of Niagara, Habitat for Humanity and so many more. So we are so proud to support them on their journey and what a great event to bring the community together in celebration of not only fantastic ribs but really an incredible cause. Yeah, we, we, it takes a lot of work to put an event like this together so obviously the Rotarians, the spouses, family members but also friends and family from throughout Niagara Falls and really across the region. We have some people come from St. Catharines, Fort Erie, Welland and so on. So we have actually about 350 different uh, time slots for volunteers. So it, it takes the whole community to put this together and we, we do appreciate the support. Also, we have some great sponsors that have been with us for a long time. Uh, the casino is one that uh, they sponsor our entertainment. They have done so for quite a few years and we really appreciate their support. Many other businesses help our, uh, our great sponsors as well. 
Since the fundraiser began in 2005, Rotary has been able to raise more than $450,000 for local community organizations. This weekend's event is expected to attract more than 22,000 people from across the region. You might have your favorite, but you can't go wrong with any of the rivers here this weekend. And in fact, The ribs are fantastic. Reporting from Niagara Falls for The Source, this is James J. Hall.